It's almost Christmas. What are you doing this weekend? Nothing special. Just working. Why do you ask? Well, I still haven't finished my Christmas shopping. Do you want to go shopping with me this weekend? I'd like to, but I'm not sure if I can. Work has been really busy lately. Why don't we go on Friday instead? Friday's not good. I think the stores will be very crowded, and I have to work. Okay, then let's try to go this weekend. I should know if I can go by Friday. Is it okay if I call you then? Yeah, that's fine. What's your number? 223-331-8828. Let me give you my email address, too. It's tom861 at gmail.com. Okay. I'll talk to you soon. Okay. Hello? Hi, Vicki. Are you there yet? Yes. I just got off the subway. I'm almost there. Sorry I'm late. That's no problem. I just wanted to tell you I'm inside. Where are you? On the second floor. Should I come to the second floor, or do you want to come down to the first floor? Come upstairs. What? Oh, can you hear me okay? I said come to the second floor. Oh, okay. What are you doing there? Just looking at some books on how to learn English. Do you want to get something to eat later? No, I'm still full from dinner. What do you want to do? I don't know for sure. When you get here, we'll talk about it. Okay, see you soon. Bye. Craig, what do you do for work? I'm still a student. What school do you go to? Boston University. That's a good school. What do you study? I'm studying English, math, and history. My major is English. How long have you been studying English? More than six years. That's a long time. Yeah, I started to learn English when I was in high school. No wonder your English is so good. Actually, it's not that good. I can read, but I can't speak very well. I haven't had a lot of chance to practice. I see. Talking with other people is very important. Yes, but I still don't have many friends here yet. I'm having a party tonight at my apartment. You should come. Oh, thanks for inviting me. I'd love to come. Hi, Kim. Hey, Sean. Good to see you again. How have you been? Okay. I didn't sleep much last night, though. I stayed up until 2 a.m. studying for an exam. I was up late last night, too. The semester is almost over. I've had exams all week. Are you going back to California after you graduate? I think so. After I graduate, I'll probably go back home and try to get a job. Do you know where you'd like to work? Not yet, but I want to be an English translator. That'd be really cool. I'd like to be a translator, too, but I don't think my English is good enough. Don't worry about that. Your English is better than most of my classmates. Thanks. Where are you going now? I'm going to study at the library. I have to take an exam tomorrow. Me, too. How late does the library stay open? I think it's open until 11.30. Okay, good luck. You too. Hello? Hi, Angela. It's Dan. Hi, Dan. How are you? Good. I called you yesterday. Did you get my message? Yes. I was taking a shower when you called. I saw that you called, and I tried to call you back. 
But I think your phone was off. No problem. I wanted to remind you that my friend is getting married next week. You're still coming to the wedding with me, right? Oh, is that next week? Yes. Did you forget? No, of course not. I already bought them a present. That's good. I want to invite Megan also. Next time you see her, can you tell her for me? Sure. Does she know your friend? Yes. I think they might have gone to the same college or something like that. I'm not exactly sure how they know each other. Are we all going to drive together? Yes. I'll pick you up first and then we'll go get Megan. Hi. I'd like to see the doctor, please. Do you have an appointment? No. When would you like an appointment? Is today possible? Yes, today is fine. What time would you like? As soon as possible. My stomach really hurts. Please wait a moment. I'll see if the doctor is available. Okay. Sorry, he's with a patient right now. It's probably going to be another 30 minutes. Would you mind waiting a little longer? No problem. May I see your insurance card, please? Here you are. Thanks. That's going to be $25 for today's visit. Really? I didn't think it would be that much. I know how you feel. I'll pay with cash. Thank you. Would you please turn on the heat? It's really cold in here. Hey, Jane, did you get the mail yet? Yes, I picked it up this morning. There were a few bills and a letter from my mother. There was also a lot of junk mail. Was there anything for me? I don't remember. Let me check. Yes, it looks like there's something here for you. Who's it from? The American Embassy. My hands are dirty. Will you open it for me? Sure. What does it say? It says your passport is ready. You can pick it up any time. Do you think you can drive me there? Sure. When? I think we should go get it now. I'm going to wash my hands, and then we'll go. Is that okay? That's fine. 